Now let's begin. You assume the working position in which the deeper side of your sacrum is the top side. In the case of this demonstration, it was the right side that's deeper, but if it's your left side that's deeper, you'll be starting lying on your other side, on your right side. For the purposes of this instruction, we're using the terms top side and underside, not right and left. So it's up to you to position yourself according to your finding when you assessed which side of your sacrum was deeper in. Working position, lying on the side opposite the deeper side of your sacrum with your underside knee forward of your hip joint, knee and hip both bent to 90 degrees, top side leg straight. With your top side arm along your side. And you lift your head a bit and turn your head so you feel the neck closest to your ear. And then you lift the top side leg by pressing the underside calf down. You swing the top side leg forward until you feel your low back push out and back. And you reach the top side arm, the direction that tightens the side of your waist and then turn the top side leg, toes down, heel up. Do it to an amount that helps locate, do it an amount that helps your top side waist to contract. Big breath in, locate your palate and slowly melt. And you lift your head, find the place of your neck closest to your ear. Press the underside leg down, top side lift. Doesn't have to be high. The top side arm, reach the armpit toward the side of the waist. Turn the top side leg, heel up, toes down to an amount that helps reinforce the strength of your waist on the side. Find your palate and slowly melt. And you lift your head. Position your head. Press the underside leg down, top side up. Reach the top side arm and turn your top side leg to the position that reinforces the top side waist. Locate your palate and slowly melt. Switch leg positions. So the top side leg is forward of the hip. The knee is straight forward of the hip and the hip and knee are 90 degrees bent. Your head lift Press the top side leg, the calf, down equally between heel and knee. Help the underside leg lift. And swing the underside leg back until you feel some pressure in the left side back of the waist. Reach the arm and steer the underside leg Toes down, heel up until it reinforces the top side waist. Make sure the knee is straight. Locate your palate, slowly melt. When ready, lift your head, position your head. Press the top side calf. Equal pressure between knee and ankle or heel. Feel the underside left leg lift and help yourself lift. Keep your knees straight. And swing the whole leg and your head back until you feel your waist go deeper. Now toes down, heel up. 
Okay, reach the top side arm. Now do toes down, heel up, and adjust to the amount of turn that reinforces the top side waist. Breath in, locate your palate, and melt. Your head, <coughs> your head lift. Underside leg lift by pressing the top side calf down. Lean your head and underside leg back until you feel the waist in back get pushed forward or deeper. Reach the top side arm. Turn the underside leg, toes down, heel up to the position that reinforces the top side waist. Breath in, locate your palate, and slowly melt. Now you turn onto your back and feel the effect. And what do you notice? This side feels closer to the table, my whole side, and my right side feels longer. In fact, my foot feels like it's about a foot longer than my left side. Mm -hmm. So when ready, turn on to your right side. And the underside knee forward of the hip. You lift your head. Adjust your head position to feel the part of your neck closest to your ear. You lift the top side leg. And lean back with your head and the top side leg rolling forward on your side, on your underside enough to keep balanced and the underside leg in contact with the surface. You bring your leg, top side leg, back so you feel your back arch a bit. You reach the top side arm and you turn the top side leg, toes up, heel down until you feel it reinforce your top side waist. Locate your palate, big breath in, and slowly melt. When ready, you lift your head. Position your head. Press the underside leg down to help the top side leg lift. Lean your head and bring your leg back, rolling forward on your side as needed to keep balance. Reach the top side leg uh, arm, reach the top side arm long, and turn the top side leg. Toes up, heel down until you feel the top side waist get reinforced. Breath in, locate your palate, and slowly melt. When ready, lift your head again. Position your head. Press the underside leg down to help lift the top side. Lean your head back, swing your leg back. Roll forward on your side enough to keep balanced. Reach the top side arm. Turn the top side leg, toes up, heel down to a position that reinforces the waist. Breath in, locate your palate and melt. When ready, lift your head, position your head, press the underside calf down equally between heel and ankle, cause the top side leg to lift straight at the knee, 
Lean your head and the top side leg back till you feel the effect in your low back on the top side. Reach the top side arm and turn the top side leg, toes up, heel down to reinforce the top side waist. Breath in, locate your palate and slowly melt. Now switch leg positions, top side leg forward, bent at the knee 90 degrees, at the hip 90 degrees, underside leg straight. Your top side arm is along your waist. Your head lifts, position your head. Lift the underside leg by pressing the top side calf down. Underside leg and head bow forward until you feel the low back decompress on the underside leg side. Reach the top side arm. Turn the underside leg, toes up, heel down until you feel the top side waist get reinforced. Big breath, locate your palate and melt. When ready, your head lift. Position your head to feel the closest part of your neck to your ear. Press the top side leg down to lift the underside straight at the knee. Head and leg come forward. Feel your low back decompress. Reach the top side arm. Turn the underside leg, toes up, heel down to a position that reinforces the top side waist. So it'll be toes up, heel down. Breath in, locate your palate, and slowly melt. When ready, your head lift. Position your head. Press the top side calf down to lift the underside. Bow forward and swing your leg forward and back and locate the best position, the most comfortable position for your low back to decompress a bit. Top side arm reach. Turn the underside leg, toes up, heel down, to a position that reinforces the top side waist. Breath in, locate your palate, and melt. Now turn onto your back. Feel the effect. What do you notice? The feet feel more even. The lower back feels slightly closer to the table. But to me, it's it's doing. It feels like it's doing its work to level out. Mm Mm-hmm. So you you might lie there long enough to allow the muscular changes you feel occurring to complete themselves and settle. Mm 